Marion Dye and Fixture is a Bradbury Group company that manufactures a wide range of custom dyes and fixtures for metal forming applications. The dedicated employees and management place an emphasis on quality. Marion Dye and Fixture is a proud supporter of the Marion community. Ludwig Trucking of Florence, Kansas is there for all your trucking needs. Ludwig Trucking has been in business since 1922. If you need something moved, call Ron at 620-382-4381. The Marion High School Boosters are always there to support the students of Marion High in all their activities. Parents, grandparents, patrons of the district, and anyone wishing to support young people striving to excel are welcome to join the Warrior Nation. Buy some warrior gear and show your colors. Come to a play, a game, a concert, or any other activity. Help boost the warriors. Check out Marion County Ace Hardware on Highway 56 north of town for all your home improvement, camping, lawn care, and other hardware needs. Marion Ace Hardware is a member of the largest retailer-owned hardware cooperative in the industry. They are committed to being the helpful place by offering knowledgeable advice, helpful service, and quality products. Helping you is the most important thing they do every day at Marion County Ace Hardware. Carlson's Grocery supports the Marion Warriors, the Center Cougars, and all the people and organizations of the area. Carlson's offers a full-service grocery store with small-town friendliness and big city selection. Newly remodeled, Carlson's Grocery has a great variety of all your favorites. Fresh produce, an outstanding deli, and mouth-watering catering are also available at Carlson's. Carlson's Grocery, everything you need right here at home. Hannah Ford Abstract and Title is a trusted name serving people in the region since 1871. They provide abstracts of title and title insurance, along with real estate closings for your transactions. With the latest in leading edge computer technology, Hannah Ford Abstract will continue to be dedicated to providing the very best of service for years to come and to supporting students of MHS. Good evening, Mr. and Mrs. Warrior fan. Tonight, the Council Grove Braves are visiting Marion, Kansas, where the Lady Warriors will take on a very hot, very good Lady Braves team. This is the Central National Bank pregame show. I'm all by myself, kinda. Mickey Lundy's here, and she's gonna, she's gonna be miking up and, and said, "Are you doing a pregame?" You uh, have to put that on first. We're going to knock this out of the way pretty quick. Council Grove, of course, a longtime uh, Cottonwood Valley League member uh, who left that league about the time everybody else did. The league folded. Uh, we play Council Grove on occasion now, but uh, certainly not regularly as we did for 50 some years. So we really don't know a whole lot about them other than I have been following uh, in the paper because I get the Council Grove paper, their uh, exploits, and they have done very, very well. So expect the Lady Braves to be tested tonight. And that is our Central National Bank pregame show. Our broadcast area sponsor is Lanning oh Pharmacy. My. Our timeout sponsor tonight will be Tampa State Bank. And our touchdown, whoop, excuse me, our three-point sponsor will be Case and Son Insurance. We'll be back with the start of the game. <laughs> Good evening oh. and welcome to All tonight. right, we are back and uh, on the air, I guess, according to what Gene Winkler just <laughs> waved at me. Council Getting ready for the uh, opening lineups. With a little luck, folks, Jandy Moore will be joining Mickey. Mickey we can all cross our fingers. Mickey Lundy, I think I said that, but if I didn't, I should. It's all right. Starting for uh, Council Grove, number 12, Cheyenne Allen. She's a 5'5 five five sophomore. And we have Corinne Parmley, number two. She is a junior, 
senior. I think she's a senior, Mick. Yeah. Number 13, Number Bo Peterson is a senior at 5'7 for the Warriors. I'm excuse me, for the Braves. I'll do that all night long. That's okay. Number three, Courtney Hansen for the Warriors, senior. Number four. Sam number Richmond. Number 15 for the Braves is Abby Good. She's a sophomore at 5'10. And number four, Sam Richmond for the Marion Warriors. Also a senior. Number 11, Courtney Herzen. Number 25 for the Braves is Morgan Poole, and she's a 5'10 senior. Courtney Herzit, number 11, is also a senior. Don't have their heights or weight. Let's just put it this way. Council Grove is taller. But they're not tall, not compared to some of the teams we've played this year. Jesse Lumen rounds out the Marion Warrior team, number 15, also a senior. Five seniors starting out for the Warriors. You know, if Chloe Burkholder could have started, we'd have had one, two, three, and four there. Well, doggone it. You know how you hit a <laughs> thing on your arm and it just... Is shoots. Allie Molliker over there? She's not a starter. She is. She's okay. I just, um, Chris Burkholder referred to her as Allie Mo here one time, and I mm -hmm. thought, well, I'll never be able to forget that because you always remember the Allie Mo. The Allie Mo. Yeah. We're a little north of that, but... <laughs> a little bit. All right, Jesse Lumen, jumping center. See who controls the tip off here. I don't have a record, but I know the Lady Warriors took second at the center tournament and had a good season so far. Well, here's good news right now. I'm going to let Jandy, Jandy Moore <laughs> take, get a breath. Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, you're coming on live, so don't say anything you shouldn't. Warriors maintain possession. I'll try to keep you posted while Jandy gets all hooked up. Hanson drives in and off. Are you on? Mm -hmm. You were so quiet. I didn't know if you're you were even on. I'm here. All right. Came Braves running. get the first two points. So see if Marion can answer back. Ooh. Oh, tried to get a pass across the lane, but it was denied. <laughs> denied. So how did the middle school boys do? Oh, we, it wasn't pretty for the C or the B game. <laughs> we all have those nights. Yeah. They're, That's okay. uh, they're learning. It's you know? a process. It is a process. It really is. We got a malfunction at the scores table. Well, Jeremiah doesn't seem to think so, but I don't know. <laughs> don't tell me what he to looks do. Pretty, <laughs> pretty content in his role there. <laughs> so, Mickey, how have you been? You, you do have a monitor to your left. Uh, Oh. Three-pointer three for the Warriors, Richmond. Sam Richmond. Way to go, Sam. Our producer is pointing out that we have a pretty new monitor up here. We don't even have to watch it live. <laughs> we can watch on TV. <laughs> oh, we probably are better off, I don't know, watching. I don't know. Do you think I that feel like I need a couch if I'm watching on the <clears throat> TV. <Yeah. laughs> there you go. <laughs> Almost a steal yeah. for the Warriors. Got Jay Smith on camera, and of course, looks like the captain's down there in his position. Got the A team out tonight. <laughs> <laughs> now that you're here. All right. <laughs> right, oh, oh, over back a little bit, but darn. With the Braves rebound, they go up four to three. It was exciting to see the girls win their center. Did they win it? Yeah. Okay, I Tournament. don't know why I thought they got second. No, unless unless face well, unless Facebook lied. <laughs> well, if it's on the if it's on the line, it's it's the truth. It's got to be the truth, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Hanson at the line. Oh. 
This is our first one. How's everybody's health? Are kids staying well? It looks I like think the there's pretty been some things, that, um, you know, that fever and sore throat. Uh, yeah. Nice job, ties it up. So, but I think these are the original starters, so, and the bench is full. Yeah, the bench is full, so should be all right. Hopefully everyone's well. I didn't do any homework as far as knowing what kind of record Council Grove has. Yeah, I, I was told they're pretty good. <laughs> well, there you How's have that? it. How's that? But so are good we. Good information. Yeah. We are good. We are good. Got a lot of hustle and talent out there. Yeah, that's one thing, you know, they're, they're scrappy little players. They are. Those girls, they know how to get it done. Oh, over wow. Back. Over wow. the back, and they are not calling that. <laughs> and hers, it's like, and I'm going to yeah, keep fighting I'm for I'm going to get it back. Good job Good. for the Warriors fighting back. Get that ball. Need someone. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody get open, right? There you nice go. Nice pass get out. Oh, now they're going to call over the back. Uh, against us. Hmm. <laughs> Two fouls for the Warriors. Tanson's first foul. Warriors are trailing by one. Counts to grow five. Warriors four. Just under five minutes. I was really hoping I was going to have time to mm. go to concession stand. Oh, no sessions for you. No. That's okay. Oh, go oh. to it. Oh. It's terrible. You watch college ball and you're so used to seeing their names on the back of their jerseys. <laughs> and I'm looking, I'm going, oh, yeah. Okay, who is that? Yeah, we don't have that. Yeah. Now, the practice little t-shirts that the middle school kids wear, they do. They're a, a nice, nice pass. Oh, great <laughs> pass. Richmond in <clears throat> five points for Richmond. She has five of the six early in the first quarter. Hanson with the one free throw. So. Boy, I figured this place was going to be packed. I mean, like, I parked out there in the North 40. I could have yeah. probably drove home and walked back over. Yeah. But... Oh, oh, get in oh, there. Oh, oh. It's right there. To... Oh, wow. Apparently all ball was it? And, yep. That's what they're calling it. Oh. 15's going to be tough to guard. She's got the height and... They can control the ball. Yeah, 15 and 25 both have pretty good height. Do we give that kind of stats as far as, yeah, they got yeah. some height on yeah. here, don't they? Good. <clears throat> yep. Abby Good standing at 5'10". Oh, that away, Jesse. Or no, that was Hanson. Oh, good thought. Yeah, it's going to be a travel. Karina <laughs> Crab checked into the game. Right idea. Absolutely. And it looks like we have a, is that a Tampa State Bank timeout? It sure is. And I just noticed Council Grove has five new girls checking in. Oh. Isn't that so interesting? They keep their legs. Yeah, they are fresh, staying fresh. I don't know. Did you do any of the um, we have sponsors? Not. We, so we, he did the pregame, and that was it. All righty. So I let's think. do the first quarter sponsors. We've got Eagle Communication, Prairie Land Partners, Marion National Bank, and Edward Jones Investments. Our broadcast area sponsor is Lanny Pharmacy. And I guess we did have that one three-point shot by Sam. We, we sure have did. Given credit to Case and Son Insurance. 150-year-old Case and Son. Wow. Are we, are we celebrating? They this are week? Friday. Oh, tomorrow? Oh, that's tomorrow. That's tomorrow. 150 Maybe I'll have to years. take off work Some, early. Is there like food and? Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes I feel 150 years old. <laughs> Uh, no. Oh, no, almost nice had the steal. Got to give them credit for hustling after it, though. Yep. 
it got quiet, hey. we could all hear their play. <laughs> Oh, nice steal by a crab. And the foul's going to be on Council Grove, so great job. Just two fouls for Council Grove. Good hustle for Karina. Yes. Jesse's nice going to go pass. up. Yeah, yeah, two for Jesse. So the score is nine to eight. Marion trailing by one. Our lights are out on our scoreboard on the Marion. Well. That's not good. No. Yes. Oh, yeah. you do. Yes, as oh. one of our new additions to MCTV, we've got the beautiful new running scoreboard and clock at the top of your screen. Yeah, so what are we supposed to talk about now? I, it's just like, I don't we know. We can't even like give the score. Thing I don't Dixie know. Or, you know. I don't know. Do you want to do a workout or something? <laughs> we could. I definitely need that after my lunch I ate today. Oh. I had comfort food for lunch. I had well, a chicken fried steak, oh, mashed potatoes and gravy. Yes. Yeah. Oh. oh, darn, that looked good. That sounds amazing. It was very good. Mm -hmm. Was there a reason for that or just because no, you could? No, Matt came to Sedgwick and oh, I took well, him out to lunch. a special occasion. <laughs> he had time to kill. Being retired, you can do that kind of stuff. I know, Go right? After it, girls. Playing a little zone defense, it looks like. Just yeah. slowing things down, and he's going to check these five back in, and I have a feeling they're going to start running this game for the last two minutes of the quarter. You got think? a little breather. Got that, I don't know. Got that inside. I just, that's just did my... Did you hear the coach holler that out? I thought. <laughs> mm-hmm. Everybody did. <laughs> you betcha. Oh, she knew oh, it. Oh, darn it. <laughs> <laughs> she knew it turnover warriors <laughs> all right let's see what our defense is made of down there three-point attempt oh wow three-point made by council grove gonna put the full, court. In the full press yep. there, we, there go. we go two on one oh, oh. Shoot. Right. Three point attempt. Get in there. Yeah. Oh, great gosh. shot by Herzig. Be a Kate's son insurance three pointer. Yeah. And keeps it within one. Yeah. I tell you what, with all the great sponsorships, it gives MC TV Channel 20 an opportunity to. Upgrade equipment. I missed out on that meeting. Did you get to I it? I did. I did. It was uh, neat to see all get the new there. improvements. Right. Great shot by Karina Crab. Gives the Marion the lead for the first time tonight. Yeah, we're very fortunate, and luckily we have Gino to. Oh, nice pass to Marion. Hustle, to do hustle, all the hustle. research and purchase and learn how to work it and teach yeah. this crew. Nice answer Wilson. again. 15 For 12 two. lead. And that's wow. the end of the first quarter. Great that's ending to the quarter. Awesome. Well done. No break. No break. No break. All right, no, no rest for the weary. Wow, so we get no no break, no break, no, no, no food, lunch break, no, no food. It is dinner time, you know. Yeah, I'm thinking. Did we sign a contract that said we didn't get breaks? I, I must not have read the I, small I print. I missed that. Yeah. Well, yes. again, we'll re-mention our first quarter sponsors. They were Eagle Communications, Prairie Line Partners, Marion National Bank, and Edward Jones Investments. And our second quarter sponsors will be Triple R Hauling, Shelter Insurance,
Perry Real Estate and the Marion Kiwanis Club. Do you have any reports that you and would like to give? I was going to say, and for our special quarterly report sponsored by St. Luke Hospital. Yes. Our report is it's 13 seconds ready to start the second quarter. Yeah, and we're <laughs> up by three. And, and darn it, that it. new system, they can see all that. They've got it all. I know. They're putting all the sponsors. Well, they have been doing the sponsors on the bottom, but. Oh, yeah. Jean's just got so much talent. I don't know why we're here. Well. <laughs> <laughs> they apparently Jay doesn't either. He's like, I don't either. Warm body. Why are you here? <laughs> Pretty soon they're going to say, you know, those voices, they kind of take away from the effects of the, you I know. just want to watch the game. Yeah. Shh. Be quiet. very, very quiet. Quiet. <laughs> oh, oh, shoot. Am I going to call a foul on Courtney? That's her second. Just making sure that's not up there on the screen. I don't, I don't see it. So, yeah, I know we don't be repetitive. No, <laughs> our Warriors have the scores spread all out three five five three five two two. So that's everybody's good. contributing. Absolutely. Oh, oh darn! Got to get that rebound. Want to take away those second chance shots for them? I must thought that was. Looking like it was going to be a travel, but apparently it was not. Yep. Oh, Muscle we got to deny, in deny that pass inside. Absolutely. And out on blue. Still warrior ball. Courtney Herzik checks back into the game for Courtney Hansen. We have two Courtneys, a Corinne and a Corinna. <laughs> I feel like you and then they wonder that have a certain name to get on the team. <laughs> oh, turnover by the Warriors. Got to break that full court press. Yep, they are pushing hard on that. And if they can bring five out and put a whole new set of five in, do it all night. I can keep them fresh that way. That away. I'm gonna be blue ball. Getting a good good job deflecting the pass. <clears throat> we have a radio station down the way calling the game. He talks a lot more than we do. He does. He doesn't have a screen for his broadcast. Three point, <laughs> point Showing shot. all the information. Help her out. Help her out. Let's go. Up down. There we go. Well done, nice. girls. Oh. oh, shoot. Back up. Back up. Got the rebound. Started over. Great job breaking that and getting that opportunity for that it layup. And that's what they got to do every time. Yep. They'll quit pressing. Yeah. They'll start making they will. them. Got to make them. Start putting them in. Big three point. Oh. That away. Good job, Corinne. Fighting for the jump ball. We'll keep see. possession. See our inbound play under our bucket. See what we got. What do we got? Oh, that's just gonna put it up. Yeah, I think if it hadn't been a little little jump, jump wobble shot. wobble, <laughs> he probably would have. There you go. Oh. <laughs> Somebody down below said travel, but. Count no. the <laughs> Must no. have been on the floor, so not a no. Yeah, no bonus either. So Hanson back in. Nice pass. 
Give him. Oh, goodness. Boy, we've had chances under there. Yeah, so we have. Settle they just down and keep taking them. Yep. Most definitely keep shooting. Good, good oh, job, Jesse. Jesse did a good job keeping her out of there and off of them. Great defense there. That's good. Oh! Stepped right into it. Oh, they're going to call Jesse for the foul. That'll Come be on. the Warriors' sixth team foul. Jesse's Jesse. second. Yep. So both her Courtney. and Courtney have two. So defense. Is he drinking my water? I don't know which one's yours. Oh, over there. It's fine. No. <laughs> I forget he didn't have headphones on. Mm. Oh, go in. Oh, darn. Out of the way, Jesse. Great job. Oh. A little bit too much on that pass. Yep. Need to stop right. them here. Need to regain the lead, don't we? Yes. So explain to me how this ended up being a Thursday night game. Do you know? I don't know. Somebody was asking me. Oh, Saturday they have wrestling. Away. So they have to set it all up. That must be. Oh, yes. But it didn't. Drop. Darn it. So she'll get to shoot too. Yeah. So it must be. middle. Is it middle school wrestling? Oh, JV. Because. The Varsity wrestling. goes to Hoisington tomorrow night. That's a long way from it home. It is a long way. <laughs> nice. There you go. I remember driving there for a cross-country meet. You drive all that way, 20-minute event, get in the car, drive all the way home. <laughs> I hope you at least got to go out to eat. I didn't even do that because I came back for a football game. Oh. <laughs> Oh, you got your hot dog when you got home then. Done with there the days. We go. Yes, great job by Hanson. Tied back up. That gives her four, five points so far tonight. Oh, I think that's a little. What? What? I almost thought it looked like a travel to me. They call it on Molliker? Yep. That's Ali Mo. Ali's first. first. Ah. That away. Good job. Good rebound. Protecting it. Need to show. Allie needs to go show some of those middle school boys how to do that. Yeah. <laughs> Who did they play tonight? Oh, they played Hutch nice Trinity. Yes. Oh my goodness. Get in there. Get that away. Way to fight, Hanson. Gee whiz, she had arms Second all over. Chance. Yeah. Gets Mary in the lead. Oh, let her get her own rebound after a shot like that. Come on, girls. That Good away. job. Hanson says, nope, not again. Nice. nice look down. In there. And nice wow. shot. Okay. Courtney to Courtney. You know, I don't think we could ever be real true radio announcers, do you? You don't think? I don't think so. You mean like do the play by play? Yeah. 
Yeah, I'll I would go. lose interest. Yeah. <laughs> Squirrel. I hate it. <laughs> I, we're just listening. To we're the, listening to the radio guy. I we're going. I know. I know. I know. He doesn't have the money. We don't have to. I'm just saying. I don't think I ever could. Even if I wanted to. They, but there would be so, there would be dead silence sometimes. We'd be like, oh, oh, do you want to know what's going on right now? Sorry. Oh, have I not told you the score for I the last quarter? I was tying my shoe. <laughs> I went and made popcorn. <laughs> yeah. That'll so oh, get. Oh, 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 oh. I, she kind of elbowed her. Yeah. Yep. Oh, that's unfortunate, boy. We tied back up. Oh, Jesse got tangled up, and I think they called it right. a travel. They did, but yeah. it, to me, she, she got rid of it. Yeah, I agree. Oh. Quickly mention our second quarter sponsors again. Triple R Hauling, Shelter Insurance, Peary Real Estate, and Marion Kiwanis Club. They are fighting for it. Nice job. Oh, shoot. A bit, they're pretty touchy on those. Uh, yeah, where calls. did these three come from? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Council grow. <laughs> <laughs> kidding. That's kidding. <laughs> but we're all tied up. So not much yep. time left. And oh, oh travel. Yeah. There you go. The whistle was a little <laughs> delayed, delayed on that reaction, one. but they got it. <laughs> Took care of it. <laughs> blow our whistle Let's up here. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> That's what we need. Yeah, just blow the whistle. Stop the game. Yeah. We have it on the video. We can show you. <laughs> Instant replays. Yeah. Be impatient. Get out of there, Jesse. <laughs> Dang it. Seconds. I know. <laughs> right when her foot crossed over, I'm like, it oh. was like, get out of there, Jesse. Oh. Oh. Minute left, tied up. Well, I would say we're holding our own if Council Grove is supposed to have a pretty good team, so. Darn it. We need to answer back. Yeah, have they a, hit a few threes. Have another good ending to the quarter. There you go, Sam. And she draws the foul. To go to the line and shoot two. That's only the fifth team foul for Council Grove. Nicely done. Great job. Nice. Two nice free throws for Richmond. Gives her seven points for the night. It's going to be hard to see these seniors go, isn't it? Yeah, they've had a great class, great group. Gonna wait. Somebody go out on her. Just steal it. Trying to make sure they can go into uh, the locker room at half with the lead, aren't they? Yep. Oh, over back. Wow. No. Who did way. they call that on? Marion? Yes, they did. Wow. There's some elbows flying there. That's Jesse's third. Oh, goodness. That's too bad. With get two seconds out. left in the game, you hate to see that. Yeah. I think Courtney Hansen took a pretty good shot to the nose. Yeah. Too. We have a Tampa State Bank timeout. Trying to regroup for the shot. So, what's some uh, reports you'd like to give? Thanks oh. to our sponsors of St. Luke Hospital. Well, I want to thank St. Luke Hospital for being a sponsor. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it looks like we've got 
what Courtney and Sam, Courtney uh, Hansen, both with seven points on the mm -hmm. board. <laughs> Courtney Hurston has two. Brenna Crab has two. Uh, hers has five. Oh yeah, Courtney hers it has five. All right, so we we saved that point there. So one point game at halftime. Not bad, not bad at all. Not Hopefully bad at all. Come out and get the wind at the end of the fourth quarter. You bet. We'll be right back. Triple R Hauling is your hauling expert. Offering custom step deck hauling in more than 27 states, Triple R Hauling will handle your heavy equipment, military equipment, farm machinery, and most any item you need moved. Hauling specialty and emergency loads, ramp use, bridges, and tarps are available if needed. Call Wally or Kim at 382-7802 and get things moving. Shelter Insurance is one of the most successful and financially sound regional insurance groups in the country, providing insurance products specifically designed to best suit you, including protection for your home, life, car, farm, business, and more. Drop in and see Shelter Agent Doug Heary for great rates and professional service. Doug will help you find the right coverage at the right price. Just as the Warriors practice and play hard to achieve success, the folks at Heary Real Estate work tirelessly to meet your needs. From listing to closing, Lori Heary and her agents are there to help you. Buying or selling, they will make sure your real estate transaction is a smooth one. Heary Real Estate, serving Marion and all of Marion County. The men and women of Marion Kiwanis Club are proud to support MCTV. Marion Kiwanis Club sponsors the annual Old Settlers Day weekend and provides financial support to Chingawasa Days and countless other organizations benefiting the area. Call 382-2115 for info on tent, chair, and table rental. Marion Kiwanis, dedicated to providing service to children and local communities. We are committed to delivering the most reliable service and original, creative programming and better quality choices. To not just meet, but exceed your expectations so you can choose your own entertainment when, where, and how you want it, anywhere and anytime. With individual plans that allow you to pick your services and have access to customer service seven days a week. Because you deserve the best value in entertainment, and it's our job to deliver it. No exceptions, no excuses. We are Eagle Communications. This broadcast is sponsored in part by Prairie Land Partners, the largest John Deere dealership in South Central Kansas, specializing in large ag, turf, and integrated solutions products. Prairie Land is always close by with nine locations and more than 250 employees. Prairie Land Partners, partnering together with you to nurture the land. Right here at home, Marion National Bank supports the Marion community and the area. Committed to serving the financial needs of our community since 1905, Marion National Bank offers full-service banking, including agricultural, commercial, consumer, real estate, and loans for any worthwhile purpose. Meeting all of your banking expectations, Marion National Bank, your neighborhood bank. Lanning Pharmacy brings something old and something new to MCTV sponsorship. Longtime sponsor Marion Health Mart is now Lanning Pharmacy a full-line pharmacy accepting almost all major insurance plans. Newly remodeled and offering everything from flu shots to medical equipment, Hallmark cards, gifts, toys, and expert advice on all your pharmaceutical needs. Lanning Pharmacy supports the Warriors and Wildcats of USD 408. Welcome back to the SAC. Marion Lady Warriors are taking on the Council Grove Braves tonight. End of the first half. Okay, I spoke too soon. Now it doesn't feel as now good. Now it doesn't feel as good. Dang it. Counts Grove 24, Lady Warriors 23. We're ready to start the third quarter. And our third quarter sponsors are Marion Boosters, Marion County Ace Hardware, Carlson's Grocery, and Security One Title. First title. Hannaford. <laughs> Hannaford. Yeah, it's hard to not just say Hannaford and Son, isn't it? Nice little pass by the Braves to give them a score, putting on that full court pressure. Nicely done. Okay. Take it. 
How you doing? Mine we feels good this time. No, nice move by Hanson. Oh, did you switch out with me? Because mine doesn't feel as good anymore. Really? I no, I don't think I did. When but I, I went to the lid as But I took my glasses off and then I put it on well, and then I put I my did, glasses but... back on. Hmm. I don't know because mine is perfectly fine now. There, I kind of just took it off my ear. Can you hear me? I can hear you. I just stuck it in my shirt. <laughs> it's like those FBI little hidden mics, you know? Oh, yeah. All mic'd up. You're just waiting for somebody to rip open your shirt and find your <laughs> yeah. wire, aren't you? <laughs> Jay's getting nervous now. <laughs> oh. Oh. Keep the no camera foul. on the floor. It a, wow. Getting rough out there. Yeah, a little bit. Go to it, White. Go to it. Take it to the bucket. You bet. You will. Oh. Nice rebound nice that job. away. Oh, what? Right oh, underneath. Oh, it was such a good thought. thought just kind of caught Sam off guard. Yeah, and Courtney's such a team player. I mean, you know, she'll give everybody that opportunity. She, she does, assist. and she sees everything. Yeah. Oh, so absolutely. So you've got to be ready because she's going to see you open and you're going to get the ball. Yep, that's right. Oh. Oh, he thought it was a travel. Hmm. So that'll be a foul on Courtney Herzit. That's her second. second. We don't need to get in foul trouble. No, no, not at all. And we're a little bit in foul trouble. Lumen has three. Herzit has two, and so does Hanson. Out of way, Jesse. Jesse. Come on. No foul, just a jump ball, apparently. Is Oh, it is. No, I think he's going in to give oh, it a foul. He is yep. Okay. All right, as long as you go both ways. <laughs> okay. I don't want to see a bunch of this one-sidedness going on. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. All right, we need some points on the board, Yeah, Mick. we do. Haven't scored since half, have we? Yeah, we've scored oh, one. Okay. Well, I was getting my equipment. Yes, you were. You get a... Technical difficulties. <laughs> you get a pass. <laughs> Oh, oh, heard that over here. <laughs> Slap her down there. 25. Second. Which, um, I thought maybe it was five. They, they get that up quick. I was thinking maybe they, they were going to turn to three instead they of They're efficient two, down there on the so. scorer's table. Absolutely. I know. Absolutely. I'll mess around. Nice look. So I'm just going to take the shot. Oh. oh. You can stop him here. Darn it. Can't let him pull away. Nope. Hate to see us down by five already. Yes. That away, draw that foul. Well, Third team foul on Council Grove. Number 12, first one. Let him keep fouling. Oh. There we go, Sam's got three points. Yep. Yes. Nothing but net. That is a case and Sun three point shot by Sam Richmond. Makes a big difference. Brings it. Oh, spoke too soon. That was a quick answer back, wasn't yes, it? Yes, that was. We have a Tampa State Bank timeout. Goodness gracious. I, you know, as nice of a day it is, I am surprised how empty the stands are. Well, I have to say, I'm right there with you. I keep looking out thinking that, that it's surely growing right. over there. But yeah, it's, 
I think the Thursday night might throw people off a little, thinking it's not tonight. Well, the calendar actually shows it on as the calendar as Friday night. Oh. It does indeed. So. so that might be throwing some people. There may be people showing up here tomorrow. Yeah. Going to have to help the... lay the mats out for the <laughs> wrestling meet on Saturday. <laughs> there you go. Maybe that's their incentive uh -huh. or their thinking that yeah. they can. Well, you know. Woo some people in. We'll put it on the calendar. And then we'll change it. <laughs> I like it. Cameraman Jay kind of scanned the crowd there a little bit ago. <laughs> While we were talking about the missing people. <laughs> the scant crowd. <laughs> oh. oh. Out of bounds on Marion. Hate to see those turnovers. Yep. Really need to stop them. They're going to have to go out on that girl. Oh, and then they rebound and make it. Seven point lead for Council Grove. Got to get those rebounds. Yeah, absolutely. We need to get back in this game, ladies. Oh, whew. Shoving around down there. Mm-hmm. Little pushing and shoving. Oh, out Hansen, of way. great rebound by Hanson. Wow. Can't get it to fall. Oh, travel. Yes. Well, oh, okay. Double, double, double. double. We'll, Whatever it is, we'll take it. Yeah, turnover. Yeah. Turnover. Marion ball. <laughs> oh. Switched out their five again there. Yeah, that is interesting. I guess if you have enough, you can do it. Absolutely. Way to draw the foul. That's four for Council Grove to our one, and she gets to go to the line. Yep, she was going up for the shot. Yes. How much do you think it helps when we kind of do our like? Oh, I think it helps oh, a lot I, I, when we lean and suck it in. Yeah. You can get in there. Yeah. Good job. And you can bring number 15, Jesse Do what we can, team players. Hanson's out. Lumen in. Doing a good job blocking out 22 down low. Yep. Keeping track of her. Oh, what's that? Good job by Richmond. Snags that up. Nice bounce pass. Great. Oh, my goodness. Wow, we needed that one. It's good all the way down. I know. They can do it. They just got to have Gonna have to just keep going yep. after it every yep. time. His layups have got to start falling. Hang on to it. Oh, help her, help her. Oh, I don't know. Fell down with it. Move her feet. She looks like her foot was pretty solid. <laughs> wow. That is unfortunate. Yep. Gives them another opportunity. Ball. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Thought they didn't call that. Yeah. <laughs> direct contact there, wasn't yeah. it? Mm 
Get out on oh. Oh, up for three. Rebound white. Great job, Herzit, fighting for that jump ball. The Marion ball. Harmley back in. Gonna give Richmond a break. No press. I don't think with this other five that they're they going don't do to, it. Uh -uh. They're not the pressing five. They're not the pressing five. Gotcha. Let's go. We need some points. We do. Mm. Nope, nope, nope. Short. Great job by Crab. It's the rebound. rebound. Oh, get in man, there. she is nice. falling all over, Woo! goes in, makes a shot, and gets to go shoot a free throw. Great job by Courtney. Persistence pays off. Yes, it does. Is her 11 for the night. Oh, oh that'll work. Jesse Lumen with the rebound. And, and another, another foul. foul. Council Grove, 16 foul. One away from the one and one. Zone five is coming in for Council Grove. <laughs> Preston five, Preston zone five. Preston zone five. We're on to him. Oh, nice Hanson inbound. Go, go in. Hanson going to go back up. And that goes Great in. job again. Just Powers over that defender and makes the shot. Nicely done. We got it back within a, a one-point ball game here. Oh, leaving her wide open. Oh, but she misses, and it will... Uh, I had a feeling it was going to be a blue ball. <laughs> Darn it. Oh, almost a step. Uh, three seconds. There we go. I was going right. to say, you, you called it on the You've Warriors. Been on that. You You've better been on be. That. You brought your stopwatch tonight. I do. 1,001, 1,002, 1,003. <laughs> Blow that Get whistle. Out. Blow that whistle. Ten seconds to get a shot off. Oh, darn it. Darn off it. the foot. Oh. Crab tried for the steal. One second to go. Again, our third quarter sponsors tonight are Marion Boosters, Marion County Ace Hardware, Carlson's Grocery, and Security First Title, or better known as Hannaford. <laughs> Got the band and the cheerleaders getting the crowd going. Definitely like to always what? hear that. Are we off? We're, I don't know. I thought he kept us running. Our we fourth, got about 15 minutes worth of stuff. We're on. Fourth quarter sponsors tonight are Marion Diane Fixture, Edward Jones Investment, Ludwig Truck Line, and the Lumber Yard. So at the end of that third quarter, <laughs> the Warriors are trailing by one. Our uh, <laughs> captain thought it was the end of the ball game, but. Anyway, there's your St. Luke Hospital report. Captain's back on the ship. We're in the oh, fourth quarter. Oh, no, that's on Hanson. Oh, no, that's three for her. Oh, Courtney hears it. Never mind. It's her. Oh, Courtney's. Wrong Courtney. but, it, but it's Courtney's third one. Oh, very good. Good foul. Okay, well, are we okay now? I, I don't we, know. I'm, all, we, I'm feeling we, a little flustered now. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think Gene's ever done that. No, He never. was packing up and walking out the door. <laughs> I'm going. I'm going. If we'd been leaving, oh. I would see that, but we weren't leaving. <laughs> we need to stay in. Yeah. We got to play the one more quarter. Yeah. Right back. We want the win. It's been a tight game. 
Good house, nice, nice pass. Nice. Way, to, way to be patient. Job. 15 points for Hanson. Nice pass by Lumen. And we are all tied up. We need good defense, good rebounding, and scoring. That way, trapper, trapper. Nice defense. Put the pressure They're on. Shifting over well. Lock oh. out. Oh. That was a three. Yep. Goodness. I thought they really had done a fine job of trapping the one gal down there in the corner. Maybe they we were really get the did. ball back. They really did. Yeah. And we will go to the line and shoot a little one and one. And that will put us in the bonus, I believe. Yep. yep. That's why we're going to go to the line and shoot a little one and one. Oh, I thought it was a shooting. <laughs> Hey, we're in the bonus. Did you, you know, know what? That? I think we are. <clears throat> I need to pay attention. See that there squirrel? Squirrel ran <laughs> by and he lost me. <clears throat> it is hard when the squirrels go by. I'm telling you, there's a lot more. <laughs> <laughs> Great job, All by right. Rose. Makes both of her free throws. She's got seven points on the board for the Lady Warriors tonight so far. Gets them back within one. That right away, her. Oh, yeah. Great on job. To Way to stick with it. There we go. Slow down. Yeah. <clears throat> like, set up a play and. Wow. Oh. Hustle, hustle. Oh, nice look. <laughs> Hate to see us turn it over without being able to get a shot off. I know it. Yeah, oh, somebody grabbed that. Wow. Shoot, gave him an easy layup. And Marion calls a timeout with three-point deficit. With a Tampa State Bank timeout. Our Warrior sponsors are the Marion Auto Supply, Gambino's Pizza, and KD Insurance. Very good. And as Jandy mentioned earlier, we wouldn't be here in your living room right now if it weren't for all you great sponsors and all of our new equipment that we've been able to add to the program. Absolutely. This is, I mean, like really uptown. And I think we have a telestrator, but I don't know. They haven't brought it out for us yet. I think you have to have so many hours of training before. Oh, oh you do? See, look. Wow. Gene, Gene's in control. He's going to work his magic. Are we shooting targets? What are we doing here? We Gosh, have those, you're going to have to turn those. that into a heart before Valentine's Day. Yeah. Oh, there's Royal. He's up there in the corner. He's the Talking best fan ever. Rimple. Yeah, he just got done watching all of the middle school Oh, my goodness. Games. So good. I say, are you coming to the high school game? Mom says, oh, probably not. Dad says, yep. Yep. <laughs> I'll be there. So is your mom here? <clears throat> I don't think so. She said, drop me off, Royal. Yep. Had enough basketball. Well, tomorrow's my daddy's birthday. Oh. And it's Judy Powers' birthday. Tomorrow? And it's the twins' birthday. <laughs> it's today's tomorrow? Yep, tomorrow. Wow. Birthday day. Oh, so, yeah. Mom probably had to go home and get the cake baked. Well, yeah. Mm hmm Big celebration. Let's see. We're we in Vegas when the boys turn 21, I believe. Great drive by Molica for two. You were in ba Vegas? Vegas when, when the, yeah. When they turned 21? Yeah. We were out there, and they were out there, and worked out well. It did work out well. No, 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 no. Rebound. White. Get Over her the off back. the back. Yep. That there away. we go. Let's and go put them in. Hey, we're shooting. Hey, we're in one and one. Yeah. Yeah, we are. One and one. <laughs> there you go. 
I'll catch on. I'm a little rusty. Well, you know, it's been it's been a long time. When's the last game you and I did? I don't 2016 know. 2016 or? Yeah, it's been a while. <laughs> Not a year and a half ago? Dean's saying, I don't doubt at all that you guys are a little rusty. You sound rusty. Get in there. Nice right job. Away. We've got the ball tied game up. tied up. No they pressure. Not Take your time up. and put it in there. Oh. No, okay, Hanson. <laughs> yeah, don't draw the foul. Oh, my. Things are falling apart. Oh, oh it's just a pin. Oh, pfft. I thought it was you. I thought you were falling <laughs> apart. Oh, well, great steal. Sometimes. Yes. Good look. Oh, yes, great oh, job. Right away. Corinna Crab just took it down. The rebound. Good Over, job by Mo. Another look down. Grab it. Oh, oh on yeah. yeah. Draw the foul. All right. We'll take Took a free throw. Line. Warriors lead by two. See if they can get two more. Three set. One yeah. more, and we're going to be in double bonus. Just hey. saying. Mm -hmm. Wow, and Mary <laughs> only has three fouls. I know. I cleaned it up this Nicely done. Queen has got seven points so far tonight for the Lady Warriors. Queen is junior on the team. Oh, oh, oh. and we get the rebound. Great job by Hanson. Oh, oh shoot. She's gonna That's going to be her third. You know, she is just, she's in there fighting all the time. And Absolutely. so you're going to get fouls called on you. Yep. Never gives up. Nope. Never gives up. Get out on those three-point oh, shooters. Oh, man. Big three-pointer. Oh, over her back. Yes. Okay, now slow her down. Be yeah. patient. Eat up some clock. You bet. Not too much, but just yeah, get Yeah, I know. Your you know, take care of it. It always makes me nervous when we spread out and get a little lax on your passes. Exactly. And like you said, in. don't want to miss that opportunity to at least put the ball up for That's a shot. Aggressive. All right. Yep. Free throws. Hey. And then she makes that one. Double bonus. Yep. So she will shoot two. Oh, darn it. Lumen and Herzit will check back into the game. Oh, man. Oh, gone. Boy, we could have used both of those just to give us a we little sure bit of a cushion. Good. Hard to block against that. Yeah, there he is. Got pretty good win, wingspan there. Oh, get in there, Corinne. Now, oh, Jesse's going to get called for the foul. That's Jesse's fourth. Darn it. And timeout for Marion. Tampa State Bank timeout. Got a weird area code calling. Or not area code, but 755. 755. Hmm. Guess you're just gonna let that one go to voicemail. I don't know the number, I'm not gonna answer it. No, I don't ever answer them either. Got the cheerleaders I, over there. I look down, I'm like, I'm confused. Those aren't our cheerleaders. Yeah, no, ours are over here. Jay's got them. Jay's got the crowd in there and the players in the huddle. <laughs> I
I think Gene wants to stay, have a stay on at the end of the game. I think he wants to do like a 10 minute post. A little bit, you're still crackly. Snap, crackle, pop. Where's the Rice Krispies? I keep forgetting they can't hear him. Gene's trying to talk to us, trying to get into our head. I thought maybe with him using that mic. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we can hear you now, <laughs> Gene. Gene's talking to us. It's not a ghost. Okay. Yeah, that, we don't have a problem with, to keep talking, <laughs> do we? Do we have a problem? With, you give us the cutoff sign. <laughs> All right, we're getting direction from the, keep the Capitan. Keep, keep the script rolling, right? Keep it going. Keep going. Oh, wow. I that, is that done. Darn, Jesse's fifth foul. That, I mean, I didn't even, there wasn't even. Yeah, that, that, was, no, a that pretty was cheesy. Touchy that was cheap. Fifth foul. Lumen goes out, two points, lots of rebounds, assists. Don't have our stat guys, so I hard numbers. No, can't give you some really hard numbers, but that's still a pretty good St. Luke hospital report. Yeah, you know. welcome. <laughs> <laughs> All tied up. Mary needs to get the ball and get down there and score. And then hard defense. There we go. Way. Done a nice job of running around and oh, that always makes me nervous. Oh. No, darn it! Wow, turnover. Lady Warriors need to get those hands up and be aggressive out there on the defense side. Uh, that's going to be four for Hanson. It's almost like the whistle just blows automatically when somebody goes up. I know. I, know. I get that feeling sometimes like it's... Really? You hear it before it gets hit. Mm -hmm. That foul has put Council Grove in one and one now. The seventh team foul for the Lady Warriors. Trailing by two, they're going to put the full court pressure on. Nope, they're going to back off. All right. The two point ball game. Nice oh, pass like, in. Oh, oh my God! Over the back. back. Yes. Yeah. Handsome. And we to needed that throw. To go I in. know. Could have had an and one. It is exhausting when you're, you know, you're constantly having to fight for it every time, like yep. she does, because, you know, they know that she's our lead. Cool. There we yeah. go. Makes her first nice free throw. Job. 16 points for Courtney Hanson. There, there we go. go. Tie game again. Got 152 to go. And a travel. Oh, no oh, dribble. Carry. Turnover by Council okay. Grove gives the Warriors, Warriors another opportunity. Really need to score here. Yeah. Take advantage of that turnover. Absolutely. Coach is telling them no foul. Yeah. Oh, don't throw it away. Take care of it. Council Grove has gone to man-to-man -to -man defense down there on the Lady Warriors. That minute and a half takes forever. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? <laughs> in this part of the game. Getting in there. Oh. 
Boy, we could have used that one. We sure could have. A minute to go. Nice rebound by Molliker. Okay. Hanson says, enough of this, I'm going to do this. Great job. Takes the lead for the Warriors. And the crowd goes crazy. Oh, and one. So they get a chance to take a one-point lead. Courtney's fourth. Heard it. Mm. All right, we got 40 seconds left to go. Go down there. It's timeout. Tampa State Bank timeout. Woo wee! Yeah, big turn of events right there. I don't remember if I did the uh, fourth quarter sponsors once or twice. Do you? I don't think so. I mean, I think you only did <laughs> that wasn't a yes or no question, was it? I think yeah, you only that. did them once. You think I only did them once? Yes. Well, I know they're scrolling across the screen, but the fourth quarter sponsors are Marion Diane Fixture, Edward Jones Investment, Ludwig Truck Line, and the Lumber Yard. So let's go, Warriors. Here we go. Yes, let's do. One, or how, wait, that's the timeout clock. 30 huh. seconds left in the game. Is that right? Ah, Jay's shaking his head yes as Marianne our cameraman. Marion has the ball. Let's see what we're going to come out, what magic we're going to make happen. Well, nothing better than getting the win at home, is there? Yeah, for sure. <laughs> Don't count your chickens yet. Uh, pay a 30 second the, play. Pay attention to the clock. Huh? It's like having a shot clock now. <laughs> yep. Shorty's going to take it to the bucket. No, Mulligan's going to get the opportunity. Yep, they're going to foul her. Oh, that's unfortunate. They had the play all set up and it just didn't go. We're going to get one more shot, though. Got nine seconds left on the board. I don't know what kind of a sh shooter the Brave at the line is, but it's got 17 points, so they should. Not, a bad shot. Not the one we want to foul. Nope. Uh, we have got to have a three point shot made. Yes, we do. Like you said, still playing time to get the ball down, but boy, then you gotta. Yeah, but you're gonna get. A, you're gonna have to get the shot off. Love that's, that's that shot sure. off. Do you uh, make a play, get it to Sam Richmond, and have her put it up for the three? She's made some three shots, three point shots tonight. So you gotta go for the three. You gotta go for the three. Oh wow. Oh, we got some replays going here on the monitor. Our fancy equipment. There's a live shot of our cheerleaders getting everybody up on their feet across the way. Pushing them through to the end here. They need your help. Well, it, it's definitely been a good ball game tonight. It the girls has. Have, have played well. Nobody ran away with it. No, it's been tight the whole entire time. Council Grove took that little little bit of a lead when they came out of the half, but yep, we quickly third, answered third back. Third quarter was a little struggle, yeah. but answered right back. Yep. Here we go, three points down, nine seconds to go, Warrior Ball. 
what they got up their sleeve. They don't have sleeves. It's really hard. Oh, yeah, she got lucky. Wow. Oh, boy. One second to go. That is unfortunate. Yeah, Just disappointing. Just got in a little hurry and disappointing. And we we really did have Again? a turnover there that they didn't yeah. blow the whistle on. So Yeah, I mean, going to get frazzled there at the end of all your Absolutely. There and Absolutely. Hey, but the season's not over. So. No, they, and they are doing well. They're going to... They're going to go far. Oh. Great. And that yeah. is a ball game. Warriors lose by 4, 52 to 48. Council Grove take it. Graves. Heck of a game. Heck of a game. Well, When's, when's our next game? Yep, I did those. Game. They're rolling. They're rolling. So we've got uh, just a little wrap up on the players that were in. Hanson ended up with 19 points. Richmond ended up with 10. Corinna Cat Crab with seven. Courtney Herzett with seven, and Moliker with two. There were a couple girls on the bench that also contributed to that scoring. So great effort, great fight for the Lady Warriors. And the Warrior sponsors again are Marion Auto Supply, Gambino's Pizza, and Katie Insurance. Post game sponsors. As post game sponsors. Says Warrior sponsors. There's another anyway, post. Anyway, are we? We're good to go. All right. We'll All see right. you next time. Right, maybe not. This <laughs> might be it. Have a great night. Bye.